the history was uh, that uh, in, in around 1968, we've been uh, participating in a lot of protests. There was marches going on, and I'm talking about hundreds and thousands of protesters and marchers at that time. And uh, we would do these uh, large canvases or, or, or get the enrolls from the newspaper. They'd give you these enrolls, you know. And we'd do drawings on them, and, and, and uh, we'd go up these buildings, uh, and as the marchers are coming by, we'd un unravel these, these images, <laughs> you know, and of course get everybody all excited and everything, you know. So I think what was happening for us as Chicanos on this side of the United States, I think that the murals for us was more of an outcry, uh, more of a protest. I mean, people started, you know, they put everything in there. Yeah. I, I went from an artist that uh, looked at a, a canvas uh, as a piece that you hang in your living room or maybe put it in an office someplace, you know. All of a sudden we're talking about walls, spaces, you know. So my whole, you know, I'm not, I'm not looking at canvases no more. I'm driving around, look, wow, look at that wall, you know. That, it was this whole world begun. I just traveled through Mexico, uh, stopping everywhere that I could to look at any kind of monumental work. I'd find mosaics, I'd find sculptures, I'd find, uh, I ended up at the Museo de, Pal de Bellas Artes. I found myself at different places and I'd come across uh, murals for all of these guys, you know? Did all you? the way to Guadalajara for Orozco's. We'd stop along the, uh, in the little towns and go to the marketplace and pick up tortillas, queso, maybe some chicken or, you know, uh, put it in the car and take off and we'd find a place off side of one of these roads, country roads out there someplace and just pull over, get some rocks, throw a little grill on there, make a little fire, cook, eat up everything, prepare our food and relax a little bit, then head on, you know. Uh, so I was very much at ease, very comfortable uh, going down there. Um, it, it, it was an experience that I, uh, I'll never forget, you know, so.